Hi, Brian Fisher here with Cape Yachts on board the Beneteau Swift Trawler 41. I'm going to give you a quick tour of the interior. This beautiful boat, really popular model, replaced the Swift Trawler 44. Uh, that was out for quite a few years, super successful. And uh, this is the next size, so let's have a look starting in uh, starting in the main so the first thing you'll notice is this galley aft design which is great has this little bar extension into the cockpit really integrates the aft platform into the uh, into the galley and your entertaining area uh, as you can see I have a cooktop you have a fridge dual basin sink uh, and the option for an oven um, right across you have a very nearly uh, home size refrigerator and freezer of course above going forward lots of great storage space for uh, pots and pans decorative or decorative items and um, anything else you might want to store have this wonderful seating area here for at least five or six people opening window if it's a beautiful day like it is today with a nice breeze going through because opposite on the starboard side, you have this large door that slides open, lets in the natural air. Also, of course, allows the captain to be able to access that side deck and help with uh, docking and communicating to the dock. Have a, uh, a helm seat here, easily built for two. Right in front of you have the um, gray marine uh, screen. Also the Yamar engine control readouts. This boat is equipped with the bow and stern thruster, making it super easy to maneuver. Um, excellent visibility. Just look at all of these windows when you're at the helm. Almost 180 degree visibility. Looking all around, you can see the bow quite easily. You can see the anchor. This boat also has a remote controlled windlass back here at the helm. Uh, making things just about as easy as they could could possibly be. Let's, uh, let's head on down below, see what the uh, cabin configuration. So down below here, you'll see that we have two guest cabins. We have a double berth over here on the port side. Nice big hanging locker. Over here on the starboard side, have single berth. And also back there you have a washer dryer unit plenty of room for storage as well which I think most people uh, some people would use that space for storage of, um, of extra items and we have a nice head a guest or day head moving forward we have the primary cabin look at that berth plenty of room to get into the bed from both sides some nice gentle short steps thing i like most about these boats these days is the windows are the windows in the top sides really gives you uh, the ability just to look outside see what's going on if a dinghy goes by or if you hear a noise or if you just want to see if it's raining out and sit up in bed in the morning have a look directly outside i think it's a great feature let's look over here on the port side it's where we have the head and a sink basin and over here on the starboard side where we'll find the shower really nice to keep those two items separate which you'll find here on the swift trawler 41. all in all just a great design it's proven to be a really popular boat already and uh, you can see why up here on the bridge of the Swift Trawler 41, start up forward, you can see really generous seating opportunity, starboard side day bed, port side, comfortable seating around that table, and keep the, uh, keep the skipper company. So you have all your controls up here to be able to uh, safely navigate the boat from up top here, just as easily as down below. You have your bow thruster controls, dual ray marine screens. Everything you would need. Excellent view of the bow from here. Just standing up over the, the helm seat. You have your co-pilot. 
extra navigator seats on either side. Looking aft here, really nice space, freestanding space where you might put a table, some chairs, maybe some teak lounge chairs. And then look at that. We have a sink and a grill, plenty of storage underneath. But uh, just imagine being up here and uh, doing some barbecuing for your friends and family right back in this space. I think you could have a pretty good time.